This is a reaction to What If The Earth Stopped Spinning For 5 Seconds by What If. I am Jeffy and here we go. Hang scary on, stuff, scary stuff. Because we're about to screech to a halt. That's right, the Earth is going to stop spinning for 5 seconds. Really? How much damage would this sudden stop cause? Yeah. What would you experience in different parts of the world? Okay. And when the Earth starts spinning again, would it still be habitable? This is what if. And here's what would happen if the Earth stopped Stop spinning, spinning for, for five, five seconds. seconds. Five minutes. Could you not be yourself? For five minutes! For five seconds! Earth makes one full rotation on its axis in one day. This gives us day and night. The Earth is spinning because of collisions yeah. that happened when the planet was forming huh. 4.6 billion years ago. I know that. As a huge disk of gas and dust swirled around the sun, Dust and rock grains clumped together. Yeah, I know generating that. Generating forces that mm -hmm. kept the planet rotating in one direction. Okay. You could imagine it much like a figure skater really? spinning faster and faster. And with almost no forces in space to slow the planet down, we keep rotating. All right. And we'll continue to for billions of years. But it's not really a circle, but is it? If the Earth stopped on a dime, would you fly right off the surface? If the planet came to an abrupt halt, uh, the atmosphere gravity. would still be in motion. There would be no that gravity. That means, though everything has lurched to a stop, powerful winds would continue to blow. Okay. And these wouldn't be a strong breeze. They would be many times stronger than any storm you've ever encountered. Huh. Now, okay. the strength of these winds would differ based on where you were on the planet. All right. At or near the equator, the Earth is rotating the fastest. Here, you'd experience wind speeds of 1,670 kilometers per hour. Really? And those winds would knock you off your feet. This is when the but Earth stops? Forget about you. These winds would be strong enough to tear up the Earth's crust. So Damn. it wouldn't matter if you were out in an open field or inside a steel-reinforced building. These that would still affect you. Obliterate you. The fuck. Damn. The strongest F5 Damn. tornadoes Damn. have velocities up to 511 kilometers per hour. Whoa. And these storms can move houses off their foundations. Oh Send cars my. flying and even tear apart concrete structures. The Whoa! From the Earth's emergency brake would be this three like times Man of Steel. stronger than that. So, if the crust under your feet didn't crumble, you and a lot of other stuff would likely go flying a great distance. Probably, but not off the face of the Earth. The escape velocity, or the speed you need to escape the Earth's gravitational forces and uh -huh. enter space is about 40,000 kilometers per hour. In oh. other parts of the world, like okay. New Zealand or France, you'd experience slightly weaker winds, but at 1,180 kilometers per hour, these would still be much stronger than any storm ever. Uh, of course. These winds would pretty much Damn. destroy everything, but mm. they wouldn't Yikes. be the only hazard you'd need to keep an eye out for in these short five seconds. Our planet is not a perfect sphere. It okay. edges near the equator due to the centrifugal forces generated by the planet's rotation. Mm. If exactly. the rotation stopped, the Earth would transform quickly into a perfect sphere. All the water gathering near the equator would flow away toward the poles, generating a massive tsunami. Whoa. Five seconds later, when the planet returned to its full speed rotation, that water would backtrack. A wall of water would slam into everything and everyone Whoa. twice. That's uh, uh, one heck of a storm. 
basically. Maybe the only place you'd be safe in this scenario is near the north or south poles. Santa would be safe. Here, the wind would be the mildest. Yeah. Santa now, would be safe. You must be relieved to hear that the Earth has returned to its normal rotation <laughs> after all this, but like I said, there would be nothing left on it. Definitely not. Every building, all farmland, and Yikes. all technology would be demolished beyond recognition. I'm again. Millions of people, if not every single person on Earth, would die from the brute force of being slammed by the massive gusts of wind. <laughs> so, if you're looking Shouldn't to be survive about that. this apocalyptic scenario, you'd better start building an underground bunker. Luckily, it's expected the I Earth am not going to do that. come to a halt any time in the next few billion years. Oof. Yeah, oh. and before that, At least. the sun would burn out and turn into a red giant. But, but that's a story that, for uh, another. What, what if? if? That's like a Disney Plus show, I think. <laughs> There's a what if Disney Plus show. Who needs this kind of stuff, huh? When we have what if episodes on Disney Plus, which are better. Some of them are, but not all of them. I expected that gravity would be affected by the Earth stop spinning and gravity is F equals MA, right? Basic physics right there. Newton's apple just fell on my head. That was a good episode. That was a good video of what if. I haven't covered what if videos before on this channel. Maybe I will do more. Depends on how this video does. Comment down below in your recommendations. As I said, I'm not really a science guy, a science expert, but I do love these kind of, you know, inform information videos sometimes. Nobody really understands the vastness of the whole universe. Anything could happen, really. I mean, an asteroid could hit us one day. A solar flare, maybe. Uh, nuclear war something these things just happen don't let these things frustrate you everyone wants to know something that they don't understand this is me i i'm seeing some i'm watching something that i don't understand and i did not understand the gravity of it all that is why i watched this what if episode because those are basically winds right the storms would be huge would be devastating that's what it is sleeping won't be a problem now I am not really affected by this. Anyways, I just hope that this doesn't really happen. Because if it did happen, that would be just devastating. I don't want to see any of you heroes out there just trying to stop the earth, okay? Leave it alone. Just leave it be. Leave it spinning, okay? Don't try and stop it. Make sure to check out one of these videos. Leave a like, subscribe, comment down below on your thoughts. And see you in the next video. Adios. Woo!